be sober of spirit be on the alert be vigilant cause your adversary the devil prowls like a roaring a lion seeking someone to devour that's peter 5 8 in the future i think of satan as as always as the predator the master predator good and perfect in camouflage he keeps transforming himself he can be anything in the garden of eden he was a serpent in exodus he is a pharaoh in gospels is a scorpions is a serpent is wolves in uh, Peter, he's the uh, roaring lion, or pretending to be a lion while well, he is not. All the same, a predator looking for whom to devour. In Revelation, he's the dragon, that old serpent. Uh, he has already mauled so many that from serpent he's become a dragon. Just realize he is the master predator hiding always in the shadows of lust and deceitfulness of sin still waiting ready to attack to pounce on the unsuspecting prey he could be in the bushes he could be in the grassland he could be in the waters he could be in the air he is all over he's checking you out quietly and invisibly is talking you it doesn't matter what kind of nature he takes an eagle a crocodile he is the one he's always looking for a way to maneuver you into a position by yourself where you're alone where he can leap out of either spiritual waters or spiritual bushes or spiritual atmosphere it doesn't matter where he'll come from all you got to know is that you got to always be vigilant alert because we have an adversary who is opposed to us in all that he does who is just waiting to pounce the more we need to be prayerful and vigilant and alert the predator is always waiting he's always looking he's always searching he lies and offers half truths of camouflage he is looking to tempt us in stepping off god's path of righteousness into a path that leads to our destruction he whispers boastfully and he makes us think that uh, we are stronger than we are it's called the deceitfulness of sin the lion stalks you the eagle stalks you the crocodile stalks you stalking is deception perfected some predators have perfected the art of stalking their prey last for sex is such a predator that stalks its prey like a lion, like a python, like a crocodile, like an eagle. The greater deceiver, the greater the deception, more often than not, he walks under the cover of darkness, the cover of waters, the cover of the sky. As a skilled and experienced hunter, he patiently stalks his prey, invisible to them, invisible, yes, camouflaged as one can get, silent stalker.